it's going too far. Here, a little more gentle. To, okay, I think that'll probably get over to those. I'm not sure if we can get those detonated. I'll oh, see they're starting to disappear too. Okay, here, we got to do this. Okay. Yeah, we must have like a little wandering horde coming through here. All right, more red dots. Got a bunch of creepy crawlies. And another vending machine. Man, vending machine city in this place. Holy crap. Door's locked. Got one more red dot. I think it's this guy here. Okay. Nothing over here to check. One more agitated Zeke. Right inside of here, it looks like. We're not being especially stealthy right now, are we? Okay, I don't see any more red dots, so everybody else is probably an outside Zeke that's aggroed. That's two outside Zekes. Alright, we might need to actually take that. Since we're taking a bit of a beating here, and we'll take that to counter it. Those Zeeks must be downstairs, I'm guessing. All right, we got a few things to loot in here, so let's check it out and see what we got. Not going to take paper. Or pipes. Oh, those aren't lootable shelves, huh? Okay. Oh, we got another safe. Okay, we'll hit that last. Let's check these bookshelves. Can we close this door? We sure can. That would be a good idea to do that, huh? Oh, good. We got some sham. That's always good for sham chowder. Nothing there. And just paper. Did we look at this one? Yeah, we did. Okay, let's check this safe. How many lockpicks do I have? I have 24, so... Um, and I've got... Two safe crackers. Yeah, let's go ahead and, and use the safe cracker on this one. I want to save at least one of those though for the in the big chest at the top. I guess it doesn't really matter. It's kind of six and one half dozen the other. As long as we don't run out of lock picks, that's the thing. Because then I'd have to break it and that would take forever. Maybe we'll find some more vending machines as we go along and get a couple more safe crackers. Oh, that's a nice find. We'll sell for some pretty good cashola. 
We already checked all that stuff, didn't we? Okay. Time to move out. Now we need to be careful of buzzards and ambushes along this little catwalk place. Got lots of red dots. Nurse Nancy. Another Nurse Nancy. Get her neck shot there. And then a Ronnie McDonnie. Feral Arlene. Miss Marlene. And that's... Is that it? I don't see any more red dots. Could be an ambush right behind this thing. Yeah, I guess that's it. Alright, I think what we have to do is get up on the duct. Or no, I guess we go through here. Oh, yeah. Okay, this is another ambush point. Except for all the zombs are on that side. There was... I, there's usually one on that side, too, but apparently not this time. And she dropped a bag. What do we have? Nice. Okay, we'll take that and that. Not going to take the alloy boots. We'll take the shoddy shells. Check her for a crossbow. Nope. Okay, we'll eat that. We'll take the moolah. That's a false positive because we already know that. Uh, wow, that's a nice find except we already have one. Probably actually worth selling. That's probably not worth selling. Five iron. No, we don't need the iron. Doggone, we're out of space again. Uh, well, we don't need the paper or the cloth, so that gives us two spaces back. But we might have to run back down to our 4 by and do another offload. Okay, watch out for buzzards. Those red dots are too far away for them to be inside this little bathroom area. Other Zeke's going to be in that room there. Okay, let's take a look in here. Come on, we gotta get at least one one toilet pistol in this place. That's our goal, okay? One toilet pistol. It's all we ask game is one toilet pistol. <laughs> Psych. So I think this just goes down to a place that's blocked, if I remember right. Yeah, blocked off by that stuff. Oh, there's a bag down here. With nothing in it that we need or want. Okay, 
So a satchel is still up on the next floor. Oh, shit. There's landmines. Not that that matters, because we can step on them without getting blown up. All right, back outside again. Oops. Don't see any red dots. Oh, now I do. Okay, some of those, if not all of those, are going to be buzzards. So let's go around this way. Oh, maybe not. None of them are buzzards. I stand corrected. Actually, I crouch connect, uh, corrected. <laughs> Alright, so before we go up there, let's jump down here and do another offload. That worked out pretty good, didn't it? Oh, we are getting close to running out of space, though. I want to keep the eye candy for the fat loots. Okay, let's move on up. Birds. What is that? Oh, that's a light. Okay. Okay, we got two red dots, but they're not in this immediate room. Man, things are smelling good in my house, you guys. My wife's making Thanksgiving dinner for us. So I'm 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 trying not to eat anything during the day. Nothing substantial anyways, so I can enjoy the Thanksgiving dinner without having a full belly. Look at that! Shepherd's pie. Oh, nice! That is a really good recipe. Really good recipe. Okay, cool. That's what we've been hanging on to the peas for all along. Very happy to find that. No more red dots in here. What's out this way? Just some locked doors. Okay, so we'll we'll be going over there in a bit. Anything over here? Lootable? Doesn't look like it. Oh, you know what? We I think we were already actually in that room. The land I think it's the landmines that are right on the other side of this rubble. Because we are now going up and there's some more red dots. Lots of them, in fact. Oh, and another vending machine. Fan freaking tastic. I don't have a good headshot on that, Zeke. Let's see if we can just get it right in the nape of the neck there. There we go. There we go. I'm going to close that door for a minute. Oh good, we got more jailbreakers and more sham. Oh, look at that. We should be able to step on that though without messing us up. Let's just confirm that though. 
That is uh, urban combat. Landmines won't detonate when stepped on. Yeah, we can step right on top of that and we'll be just fine. See? We're stepping on it. Look at us and our bad selves. All right. A couple of mega crushes. That's always nice. Mega crushes is, is a valuable thing, but it's one of those things in this game where the only put, the only time it's really going to be useful to you is in the early game. So you know, by the end by the end of the game, you've got like a couple stacks of them, and you've never used them because you don't really need to. You know, you only would use them if you're out in the open and you're running from something, and the only time you do that is in the early game, right? So kind of sucks, but we pick them up anyway because they are valuable. Yeah, those are the landmines down there. Let's go on in here. Got a red dot there. No red dots over that way. Come on, toilet pistol. Doggone it. No toilet pistol. What the hell, man? Uh, we will take that, actually. There's a few things I want to turn black. Let's turn our... our duster black. Oh. That doesn't look as dark as the blue does. Well, screw that. We're going back to the blue then. I know this doesn't really matter. It's just role-playing, but it's still fun. Um... Will the shirt get darker? Actually, no. Let's leave the shirt the way it is. I like my weapons to be dyed black, too. Why? I have no idea. It doesn't make any difference whatsoever, except for that it looks cool. Let's get rid of that stuff there. Get rid of that. Uh, all right. Well, I guess we'll just make our, we'll make our pick black for now. But when we get back to the base, I think I might have a weapon or two that that needs to be black. So, okay. No red dots in here. Toilet pistol? Dang. Okay, out on the duct work. Peeled for buzzards. Lots of red just showed up. But it looks like they're all inside. And say, what the hell, man? A red dot uh, over here. All righty. Satchel is still up on the next floor. This looks like a surgery prep area, maybe, or something. We've got a door here. Toilet pistol? Damn it. Damn it, Jim. There's a brass lamp over there. Don't want to pass that up.
Um, yeah, you know what? We'll take these for uh, for medikits, large medikits. Okay, we got red dots. All the red dots in this immediate vicinity, but there's going to be one in there, I'll bet you. Well, maybe not, unless there. Yeah, I guess there isn't any in there. Okay, did we look in all these? We did not. Don't care about that. And that's really probably about it. All we need to loot here. Check that picture. Nobody in here, okay. That Zombo just despawned. So I guess we're supposed to go out. Are we supposed to go out here? Well, the door's locked, so yeah, I guess we go up this way. Follow the lights. That's what you gotta do, is follow the lights. Little ammo pile there. Bathroom. Toilet pistol. Not happening. Uh, we'll take both of those things. Steroids is another thing that I usually accumulate a whole crap ton of and never actually use them, unless, except for the very early game. Mostly for the, um, you know, the buff that you get for, um, being able to carry stuff. Removes encumbrance. We'll take that for putting on a weapon to sell. All right. Time to go this way. How are we doing on our inventory? We're getting pretty close. We don't care about that and that or those. That brings up a couple spots anyway. I think this uh, room's going to be have some resistance in it. So far, we haven't really seen any really nasty Zikos. Whoops. Misfire. But if I remember right, the last time we came to the surgery room, there were some nasties in there. Like irradiated biker nasty. Okay, let's see what we got. Yeah, see? <laughs> We got the irradiates in here. Okay, so this is going to be a little bit more involved. Look at all the red dots in here, man. Okay, so what we're going to do for this room is we're going to load up these. And we're going to put Junkie down here. And we're going to, um, where's my pipe ops? There we go. That's how you do it. Those son of a bitches didn't get a single finger on us. <laughs> All right. Those red dots are a long ways off, so we don't need to worry about them. Is 
Let's loot. Um, we'll take those and we'll take that because we already have some back at the uh, Jeep. Speaking of which, we're going to have to make another trip back there really quick here. Don't care about that. Don't care about that stuff. We'll take that. That's where we got to go. Uh, the satchel is on this level, and it looks like it's right here. Whoops. Do we have room for it? Um, let's eat a chicken soup. Okay, satchel's done. Now we just got to finish clearing. What we're going to do is move through here, but we need to get, you know, back to uh, the 4x so we can offload. There we go. I keep checking behind these places and I don't find anything, but we finally found something. Red dots. Those are all going to be across the way there. That is not a lootable. Nothing behind there. Oh no, we don't want to use these. Okay, so that's the way we need to go up, but what we're going to do is we're going to go back down this way first. Okay, let's continue on. We're getting close, guys. We're getting close. Oh, it's a buzzard. First, I thought that was like a pile of ruined stone. Creepy crawlies. There's a dog. Uh, 
Um, I don't think I'm going to take either one of those. Flashlights are just really not worth all that much. It's not worth taking up this inventory space. Oh, we didn't kill him in one shot. Must be a feral. <laughs> oh, we got him with the bleed effect. That was hilarious, man. He's just sitting there like that is with the freaking uh, <laughs> crossbow bolt hanging out his noggin, sticking out his noggin. That was funny. I love those humorous moments in this game with these zombies. Fun, fun, fun. Okay, so it looks like we were already in there. That was one of the very few shots that we've done that hasn't been a, a single, you know, a one shot. But it does happen, especially with these ferals. Um, all right, looks like we got to go up that way. Let's just double check and make sure everything else is clear on this floor. Yeah, I think we're good. All right. Red dots over that way, red dots over this way. Where's he at? What? Ooh, is he up here? No? That's weird. He must be up above us then. Hmm. Suggest that he's right here. Doesn't make sense. Huh, I don't know. Okay. That's really weird. They must be above us. That's worth fixing up and selling, especially if we can put a mod on it. Yeah, I'll bet you those guys are up above here. Okay, so that's the the gap on the other this on the other side of this door is where all the fat loots are. But we will get that uh, at the end here. I don't see any buzzards. Now I do. It's dark out here. Buzzards galore.
Man, it would suck aggro in all of those budgets all at the same time. It would indeed. Almost to the end. Got a big old ammo pile in here. Okay, so this room is actually a really good room because it's a place we can retreat to if we aggro the, you know, the whole lot of the baddies up on the roof there. That's uh, how we played it last time, and I see no reason not to do the same thing this time. But let's see how many of the baddies we can dispatch one at a time first. Oh, oh, ow. That's a lot of badness, you guys. Holy crapola. Um, damn. Okay, let's get all the way up here. There's not a whole lot of zombos in here. I'm going to be able to one-shot it during the day. Okay, well, here. Let's get this big mama. That is some really bad nastiness. We could get him, but I don't know if I want to shoot between Arlene's legs. <laughs> don't think that would be a good idea. Okay, so here's how we're going to play this. Let's get this loaded up here. Now, if I can throw these pipe bombs correctly, in other words, close enough to each other, we could kind of do a chain reaction explosion. We tried to, to do that at the Shotgun Messiah, but I had them too far apart. Oh, that one went further than I thought it was going to. Okay, we'll put one there. One there. One off that direction. That's too far. We need one closer to set off those. Yeah, I still don't know if that's going to get all the way over there. Okay. So, let's... No, it's going too far. Here, a little more gentle. To, okay, I think that'll probably get over to those. I'm not sure if we can get those detonated. I'll oh, see they're starting to disappear too. Okay, here, we gotta do this. Yeah, they were starting to disappear. No, not that. What the hell? Where's my, my junkie? All right, let's get ready. This is gonna be do or die. I don't think we're even hitting him. <laughs> get him, Junkie! Off with his head. That's another one. Turn to traitor. We did it. Yeah, yes. We did it. All right, cool. Why do we still have scary zombie music playing? I don't know. <laughs> well, that went pretty well. Um, they never touched us once, so hey, there's that, right? I don't know that we probably didn't kill any of them with the explosions, but I'm sure we we softened them up really good. Anyway. All right, let's check out the fat loots. Get these guys broken here. 
Get some stamina back. Come on, come on, come on. There we go. Okay, how much room do we have? Not a ton. Um, yeah, I'm probably gonna have to come up here for a second trip. So let's just let's open the stuff that's gonna break first. Yeah, we don't care about that. Um, I didn't mean to do that, but okay. We'll eat this, and we'll sell that impact driver. Um, we can take that. And we'll take that stuff. Okay, so that gives us... You know what? Let's just make some duct tape with this, because... Because we can. Okay, let's check the weapons bag. Decent stuff. Is this junkie better than our current junkie? It is not. Okay, so we will sell that. Don't care about that. All right, we might be able to get this all in one shot. So let's go ahead and take the uh, jailbreakers. We will take the eye candy. And I forgot to put my luckies on when we double looted earlier, but oh well. I'm remembering to do it now. That's the important thing, right? Um, okay, let's see what we got. Should have actually take, done all that before I opened the weapons bag, too, but at least I remember to do it on the fat loots. Here we go. Okay, decent stuff, but not the best in the world, but we'll take it. So we got to get rid of three things because I don't want to come all the way back up here. We don't need leather. We can eat the cat food because I don't think that's used in any recipes as far as I know. And let's drink this mineral water, I suppose, or we could chuck the bones. Let's chuck the bones. Beautiful. All right, guys, that is it for this episode. We got through here pretty quick. We really did, actually. We moved through here very quickly, considering how, you know, along of a POI this place is, being a Tier 5 and whatnot. Um, so I will meet you, what time is it? 17.31. Um, I'm going to hightail it back to the trader. Hopefully we can get back there before uh, the trader uh, closes. I just got to know which way to go. So here, let's go back here really quick. Uh, show on map. Okay, so, uh, yeah, actually that trader's not that far away. So we just go south and then um, over here. So I'll meet you over at the trader for the turn-in. Trader Jin. Don't spend it all in one place. A rocket launcher and some first aid benches. Well, we're going to definitely take this because it's worth a lot more. Remember, we did loot that purple rocket launcher earlier. All right, Jin, do you have any more jobs? You look like you could handle yourself. Okay, factory Why two is Shaka Messiah. We don't care about that. that job is done. We this need is to the tough jobs. okay. This is Shamway, but um, so not... if you do this for me, and that's I, Shaka Messiah. Take a job. Okay. I'd be glad to take my commission. And here's a tier yeah. five too. Uh, yep. Yeah, okay. So we're not going to take any more jobs from her because she's so far away. Um, however, she should job. have a new inventory. So let's take a look at that really quick while we're here. Art of Mining Volume 5, we'll take that. Compact Stacks, okay. Let's look at her main inventory. If she has another... Okay, yeah, I'm going to buy both of these just because I can't make them right now. We'll probably need them to repair the Horde base. I seem to lose one of those each time. Wouldn't mind the two awesome sauces. I, knew you'd find something you'd like. I mean, I can make those myself, but they take honey... And um, they take five honey, so it's just easy. Since we got so much money, it's just easier to buy those. Okay. Got some rocket ammunition. Okay. Thank you so much. She hey, doesn't really have anything else we want. Let's see. We'll take some more covert cats. We never actually used those. Um, all right, we need room. Let's see. 
We, I want to take all of that stuff. Well, not all of it, but all the stuff we normally would take. So anyways, guys, I'm going to figure that out. I'm going to let you go here, though. Hope you guys enjoyed this episode. If you did, please hit that like button, subscribe to the channel, leave a comment, share the video. And uh, again, I know this is going to be, you know, over a week later for you guys, but I just want to wish you all a happy Thanksgiving anyways, belatedly. And I uh, hope you guys have a, a good time with your family, friends, eat lots of turkey, all that good stuff. So we will catch you in the next episode. Bye-bye.